It's not what you say out of your mouth that determines your life. It's what you whisper to yourself that has the most power. In school, we learn that mistakes are bad and we are punished for making them. Yet, if you look at the way humans are designed to learn, we learn by making mistakes. We learn to walk by falling down. If we never fell down, we would never walk. Winners are not afraid of losing, but losers are. Failure is part of the process of success. People who avoid failure also avoid success. You're only poor if you give up. The most important thing is that you did something. Most people only talk and dream of getting rich. You've done something. If you're the kind of person who has no guts, you just give up every time life pushes you. If you're that kind of person, you'll live all your life playing it safe, doing the right things, saving yourself for something that never happens. Then, you die a boring old man. The love of money is the root of all evil. Emotions are what make us human, make us real. The word emotion stands for energy in motion. Be truthful about your emotions and use your mind and emotions in your favor, not against yourself. I'd rather welcome change than cling to the past. The single most powerful asset we all have is our mind. If it is trained well, it can create enormous wealth in what seems to be an instant. If you realize that you're the problem, then you can change yourself, learn something and grow wiser. Don't blame other people for your problems. Workers work hard enough to not be fired, and owners pay just enough so that workers won't quit. As I said, I wish I could say it was easy. It wasn't, but it wasn't hard either. But without a strong reason or purpose, anything in life is hard. To know a little about a lot. We all have tremendous potential and we all are blessed with gifts. Yet, the one thing that holds all of us back is some degree of self-doubt. It is not so much the lack of technical information that holds us back, but more the lack of self-confidence. Focus. Follow one course until successful. There is a difference between being poor and being broke. Broke is temporary. Poor is eternal. There are those who make things happen. There are those who watch things happen and there are those who say what happened. The power of can't. The word can't makes strong people weak, blinds people who can see, saddens happy people, turns brave people into cowards, robs a genius of their brilliance, causes rich people to think poorly and limits the achievements of that great person living inside us all. Learn to use your emotions to think, not think with your emotions. Success is a poor teacher. Excessive fear and self-doubt that were the greatest detractors of personal genius. Most people fail to realize that in life it's not how much money you make, it's how much money you keep. What do you think about me is not my business. The important thing is what I think about myself. The size of your success is measured by the strength of your desire, the size of your dream, and how you handle disappointment along the way. Money is just an idea. Intelligence solves problems and produces money. Money without financial intelligence is money soon gone. Leadership is what you need to learn next. An intelligent person hires people who are more intelligent than he is. 
The poor and the middle class work for money. The rich have money work for them. If fear is too strong, the genius is suppressed. People who avoid failure also avoid success. There is always risk, so learn to manage risk instead of avoiding it. Going into our fear and confronting our greed, our weaknesses, our neediness is the way out. And the way out is through the mind, by choosing our thoughts. Today, wealth is in information. And the person who has the most timely information owns the wealth. It is not much different from a person who goes to the gym to exercise on a regular basis versus someone who sits on the couch watching television. Proper physical exercise increases your chances of health, and proper mental exercise increases your chances for wealth. Laziness decreases both health and wealth. You will never know true freedom until you achieve financial freedom. At the point the money hits your hands, you have the power to determine your financial future. Once again, the 90 tenths rule of money applies 10% of the borrowers in the world use debt to get richer 90% use debt to get poorer. They get up every day and go work for money, not taking the time to ask the question, is there another way? Everyone wants to go to heaven, but no one wants to die. We only memorize historical dates and names, not the lesson. Find the game where you can win, and then commit your life to playing it, and play to win. Balanced people go nowhere. They stay in one spot. In today's fast-changing world, it's not so much what you know anymore that counts, because often what you know is old. It is how fast you learn. Choosing what we think rather than reaction to our emotions. It's not how much money you make. It's how much money you keep. Accounting is possibly the most confusing, boring subject in the world, but if you want to be rich long term, it could be the most important subject. There is an old cliche that goes, job is an acronym for just over broke. Thinking is the hardest work there is. That is why so few people engage in it. The only difference between a rich person and poor person is how they use their time. The single most powerful asset we all have is our mind. If it is trained well, it can create enormous wealth in what seems to be an instant. The lack of money is the root of all evil. 